Nerd Reactor, roll out. What's up, Reactorites? John here, and it's time to check out the newest episode of HBO's Westworld. And in the, uh, the last episode, you know, we get to see the continuation of what happens in the theme park. And Dolores, she rounds up some people. Uh, they start to take over and pretty much kill all the uh, the the higher ups, uh, the board members, um, and so yeah, you have some of the people trying to run away, still trying to find a way to escape, and we also get to still see different timelines going back and forth until the uh, you know the events after the first season and. Probably something that happened like weeks after. And so, yeah, uh, I'm just happy to see that the show is still, uh, you know, drawing in a lot of mystery and a lot of quest you know, questions, a lot of confusion, what's happening. And so pretty much Dolores, uh, her end goal on what she said to Teddy is that they, she wants her and Teddy together in the end. She is on that war path of just... Uh, Taking out, taking out people, I guess, and uh, having uh, a place for the host, uh, you know, uh, a safe place for them to live and not have to deal with uh, death and destruction and all that. So, yeah, let's check out the uh, next episode. You're in our world. What? What? You brought her out? And I thought this was the future. Hmm. I don't think I could ever get used to this. Hmm. Yeah, because you want to take over it. It's almost time, Arnold. <gasps> Ford! Is she ready? So does that mean you remember this? Wow. What is this place? Bicycles still exist. But sometimes I think we're simply not the ones who deserve it. Don't say that. Don't say that about the humans. The stars have been scattered across the ground. Uh oh, you're repeating? Have you ever seen anything so full of splendor? Oh, you're repeating yourself. And. We should go, Dolores. So soon? Crushed. I'd like to see it again. Oh, yeah. I'm thinking you will. <laughs> Still alive. It's a fucking slaughter up there. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Are they coming down? They're coming down. Oh, no. Indeed, there is. Oh. Ooh. Don't kill me. Teddy. You have no idea what you're up against. What is out there? Yep, you remember. It's beauty. Come on. I've been there before. Ooh. Oh no. I will leave that to the expert. Yes, young William is back. I believe that guy's dating my sister. Ha! Huh. Dating her? Is she, uh. Is she real or a host? Mr. Delos. Mr. Delos. <gasps> My father wouldn't know the future if it slapped him on his bare white ass. <laughs> I thought this was a private demonstration. I think you'll find the company quite stimulating. <gasps> that means everyone's a host? Logan, this is a private demonstration. And it's already begun. Ah. See if you can pick them out. Oh, shit. <laughs> Delicious. You're going to pick out. Yeah. Hmm. Who's the robot? Hmm. What if everyone is host? Every single person. Ah. They're all so painfully human. Uh oh. No. Yes? No way. <laughs> the future is now! I'm real. <laughs> too perfect to be one of us. So if you want my full endorsement, huh? 
You're gonna have to prove it. Ooh. <laughs> Show your face or. Oh shit, everyone's frozen. Oh shit. <laughs> Welcome to Westworld. Oh, damn. Sign me up. Him too? Wait a minute. We're not here yet. Nobody is. Hmm. Except for Ford. We're here, Mr. Dunham. All ours is here. You. Take me to Westworld now. <laughs> and he's sold. Uh oh. Oh, is he dead? It's time to open your eyes. No, Teddy. No. Your innocence. Oh, no. No. I don't know. You know why. Why didn't you do this? I didn't. Oh, shit. Why do you do this? Oh, I need. No, oh, Teddy. Who the hell is it first? Just for fun. Don't say that. <laughs> We're fun to you? Don't turn to the dark side. I reckon they'll start at the top of your little brown head. Oh, hey, 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 hey. <laughs> Have time for the preliminaries. Oh. Still a good shot. Uh oh. Oh no. Ooh. Oh. We can bleed. Oh. Then I'm gonna burn this whole fucking thing to the ground. Oh, are you gonna do that? Oh no, who's that? Who's that? Ooh. Ow. It burns. It burns. Poor guy. He has a new job to do. Uh oh. Where's Felix? Oh no. Who are you? You are wearing black. It's awfully fucking pretty. Oh. It's perfect. Ah. This is the only place in the world where you get to see people for who they really are. Ah. And if you don't see the business in that, then you're not the businessman that I thought you were. Ooh, damn straight. It's kind of like Facebook. That's not a man alive that talked to me like that. Not anymore. Mr. Dellis. A long way from home, haven't you? We're bound for the future. Hmm. Or death in the here and now. Is that right? Well. Best of luck. It's like I want to do my own thing. Yours is the only way to fight. You feel free to command everybody else. Ooh. Oh, hey. Try it, my man. I know you. Teddy. Do you feel free? Uh oh, you're conflicted. Little patch of land you've been talking about, but never been brave enough to take. Ooh. Did you think you know about glory? I know you'll never make it there unless you're under my command. Oh shit. Flip the table. Oh shit. Why don't we enlighten them? Uh. Ooh. Yep. Ooh. So talented. Molly, come here, please. Do they know? <gasps> William. <gasps> Do you remember? Oh. Oh. Hello. You sent time for the entertainment. Yeah, well, <laughs> some of us uh -oh. can afford to have more patience than others. Oh, you're getting sick? Keep playing, girly. You're anything but fucking sure. Huh. He sent you down here to keep me company. <laughs> May her forever be blissfully short. That one's bitter. In the past life, you used to be him. <laughs> and Lazo. Lazo. You look like Gus. I won't be lying with you. To the bitter end. Oh! 
game was meant for you, William. Oh, hey. Hey. But you must play it alone. Okay. Oh. Oh no. Oh. It's gonna make things harder. I'll see you in the valley beyond, William. Oh. There goes El Lazo. Fuck you, brother. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hey. Hey. In this place we're going, it's my greatest mistake. What did you build? You really are just a thing. <laughs> hey, boy, don't be mad. Turns out you're not even a thing. Hey, 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 hey. A question no one's ever even dreamed of asking. What is it? What is it? Who are we? Do you want to see? How evil can we become? Have you ever seen anything so full of splendor? Oh, the, uh, the secret thing you're building from the last episode? Okay, all right. Doesn't matter what you call the it, outside. I know we're going to find that. The outside. My old friend was foolish enough to show me. Hey, not Arnold. It's a weapon. Huh? What? And I'm going to use it to destroy them. Ow. Nuclear? Nuclear weapons? Um. Um. Okay, so yeah, Dolores is still on the path of destroying mankind, and uh, it's kind of sad that the whole Arnold and Dolores relationship, you know, of just caring for each other, learning more about each other, and being fascinated by each other, it's now Dolores is on a different path, and so yeah, the thing about uh, the, an old fool, so I'm guessing that's, you know, it's Arnold, and showing her the outside world, the valley beyond, so that uh, I think is representing, you know, uh, our place. Um, how is she going to get there? Uh, that's going to be interesting, and what is the thing that's going to uh, destroy us so uh, could be uh, something big or maybe it's something like secretive and but this episode I I'm glad to see like some of the characters back like uh, you know young William uh, we get to see uh, how he tries to uh, run things and uh, how to purchase Westworld uh, uh, and then you know Logan what happens to what was his initial reaction when he found out about the host and how lifelike they look so it's it's kind of cool to see that where he's still astonished by it and so before i was probably thinking like there's been a gradual uh in terms of technology on uh, robotics on how you know now we have the one where it's like the uncanny valley where they're trying to make it look realistic but it's still kind of creepy and we can still kind of tell that they're fake so i guess in this world of west one in the future it's they're still not there yet like publicly but in secret, Ford and Arnold have created robots that look really lifelike. And I guess they haven't shared it with others yet. And so that was a moment where I'm like excited for Logan. Like, wow, this is this is cool. This is creating lifelike stuff and uh, being able to just do whatever you want. It's uh, it's nuts. And that's pretty much like it's a theme park where you can just... It's a playground. And we get to see... William on how he is trying to sell the idea to uh, Logan's father, uh, Mr. Delos, on how to, on why they should get Westworld and what they can do with the information, especially with the guests, uh, you know, what they're willing to do. That's like the ultimate survey and the ultimate uh, information of what people really, really like and what they really want to do with nobody's watching and if they can do whatever they want um, so it kind of like reminds me of what we have now with technology and uh, social media on just what we're saying and uh, you know like for example Facebook uh, let's say people like to write messages private messages and all that and you know Mr. Mark Zuckerberg is probably out there reading things and uh, they already revealed how they have certain keywords and if it pops up they'll like if it it's 
life threatening, they'll do something about it like on a big scale. And so pretty much our privacy, we never really have privacy if it deals with the uh, technology like that. And so it, it kind of, for me, I see the parallels with the Westworld where uh, we're really not having a private moment if we're doing these uh, sinful things and because Delos is there always watching, they're keeping an eye. And so that's a... Uh, uh, that's a very interesting, uh, just an interesting take on that. As for William, uh, older William, um, what's his, he's still trying to figure out stuff and then he's still pissed off at Robert, um, you know, trying to make things harder for him. And so we still know that William has uh, a lot, you know, a lot of control. He's still planning things, making certain parts where I'm not sure if Ford knows about it, uh, especially with that area that they're building and so what makes this area different than the other areas like how special uh what makes it special and i'm thinking that's the same area with the uh, at the end of the uh previous episode so something about that spot and another cool thing is that you would think that all the robots would band together and team up but that's not the case because dora still has to fight for her way to convince uh, different people just, just so that she can raise her army and she also tried to c convince Maeve but Maeve is like if you true you know it's like uh, freedom we're fighting for freedom so if you really want the robots to have freedom let me go and so uh, Dolores lets Maeve uh, pass and the, uh, the others so that you know Maeve can continue on her journey to finding her daughter so that's pretty cool and hopefully we'll see you know her going into Shogun world and all that so I can't wait for that uh, but yeah, so great. Another interesting episode of Westworld, and I'm looking forward to the next one. Let me know what your thoughts are on this episode on the comments below. And also, I'd like to thank our patrons on Patreon for helping this channel continue and grow. Also, like, share, subscribe. We also have a Facebook group. Join that. I'll be there. Other reactorites will be there. Uh, you know, we, we can chat and do the Facebook thing that people are doing and have Mark Zuckerberg... Uh, you know, uh, find out information and all that and uh, spy on us. <laughs> so the link to the group is in the description below. With that said, I'm John and I'll see you guys next time.